Okay guys, we're back and I'm just going to turn this right on again. And I gotta see if it keeps the settings that I uh, uh, it's on the D discrimination 2 still and I'm just interested to see if it does the tones frequency shifts 4 volumes 20 and I see it state it went back to 4 so you got to put it back each time if you only want a different tone So that's good to know. I'm just going to sit it down here and put my other glove on. The, uh, <clears throat> so each time you turn it off, it won't keep the settings that you already had in there. Okay, I've got it on manual ground balance now too. The coil looks a lot like the Fisher, but it's actually a lot thinner and lighter. Went to 77. It, uh, it's a little smaller. I think they call it 11 by 5. But it's not heavy by any means, it's a different type of material. What is it? The pen. Yep, pen. Somebody dropped their pen. almost like fall out here today. Jesus. No leaves on the trees. And... Tab. It's got a little bit of snow even coming down. come up into the 80s but it's I think it's hailing off haloing off of that iron I don't mind cherry picking here and there because like I said I always come back to these spots they're regular spots of mine not to zinc when I get tired or <clears throat> I get my back bothering me or something and, but when I'm 100% then I get more aggressive with everything enjoying this time of the year actually because there's no one around
broken up. <clears throat> but and you get your uh, chains and stuff will act like that too. So it's 84 right here. Problem with your gold chains is they make uh, broken up noises and well, this is a strong signal, whatever it is. And oh, I thought it was a loony, but it's a cop. Get that wet soil in them this time of the year and. They read a little higher <coughs> from what I found. Yeah, when the weather gets better, I'll be able to take that case off. <laughs> Probably if I was wearing the hair headphones too, I could judge the tones a little better. That came in and grunting, and now it's screaming. There's nothing shallow there. <clears throat> I believe shallow. But it brought me a grunt at first. There again, it's a pretty good target, and it's another cap. Yeah, Mike's hard lemonade. Bastards. but uh, it's excited <clears throat> I haven't got a ring yet this year either I haven't been a lot but yeah pull tab it was close close to the top in the 60s. I try to dig everything. There's a lot of guys that just cherry pick and they've got the pennies figured out and they don't even bother digging them but I try to you'll, you'll notice over a period of time you'll get the park pretty cleared up where you get all the junk and stuff out and it's uh, it makes it a little easier hunting. Like I said, I don't get too worried about because I, I hunt them regularly, all these places. Especially these ones that are close to my house. It's all over. There's probably another tab. <coughs> well, 
I gotta go back tomorrow to work, so it's not bad I ended up get, getting an afternoon shift instead of uh, her uh, more of a day shift in an afternoon, so there we go, another pull time. They changed it on me there. Give me a text. I do 10 hour shifts too. It's pretty hard to do in the morning stuff if you're working 12 to 10. It sort of screws your morning up. That's 83, 85. But then I'm off for three days after that, so I only got two. So I should be able to get a fair bit of hunting in. Oh, it's a cap. Another blue light cap. It's tricking me. Oh. The clear signals, though. I'm really dependent a lot on this VDI, which I shouldn't be. When the numbers bounce, well, what I was watching the, uh, the Texas digger that uh, it's usually junk. If it stays within one or two or three digits, then it's uh, stuff there but it wants to sing on the side of it so that's like a halo effect I'm gonna give it a ground bounce see if that cleans it up a bit So what they've been that's been beer caps, hasn't it? <coughs> yeah. So we know the eighty twos <laughs> here anyways are beer caps. How they get here? There's supposed to be no drinking in the park. This is 87 to 90. This has got to be a coin. A lot of grubs, every hole. Gets into those 90s, you know, pretty well know it's a quarter or dime. Seems to be fairly deep. Could be 
I'm going to cord it. <laughs> See, uh, at least these quarters I am getting are older ones and they're deep ones, deeper ones. So we've missed them and mistaken them for iron before. Now, I don't know how this thing is going to play out for depth, but I'll tell you that uh, that macro 77, it, uh, it's good. It's deep. I know that's a deep machine for sure. That's a penny copper. But that's weird that that is reading that high. But it's nice to see that our Canadian clad reads that high because a lot of the machines don't ring it that high. <laughs> well, pennies always do, but I mean. big overload there I'm saying this is a beer cap because it's 82, 84. <clears throat> Let's double check. For reference. No, pull tab. Heavier one. <clears throat> 